Shadow. Good. Yeah. You guys have no idea how much work that took for her to be able to hear her name and actually look to the person saying it is huge. Shadow. Good. Good girl. That's really, we spent so much time on that yesterday. Cause you used to say her name and she, she would look anywhere but you. And they just be like, what? I don't hear anything. Good girl. I like that. A lot more relevant today. Yesterday's lesson stuck. Frank. Yay! Oh, wow. Good girl. Oh. 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 Wow. Wow. Oh. Oh. Wow. Okay. Okay. It's good. This is good. She used to bark a lot. Cookie. Yeah. Shadow. Dogs too. Cookie. Place. Let's see here. What's this? Josh is being non obvious on purpose. He wants her to look up at him for the answer and pay attention. Because she had such a problem with ignoring. Place. There it nice is. Good girl. Good girl. That's a good girl. She's got a puzzle to solve. Good girl. That's beauty. Here comes some attitude. She knows what you're asking. Yes, for sure. She doesn't want to get on the bed because she knows that means she's not involved. Please. She says I'll recall instead. Maybe if I sit in front of it. Anything but get on, because getting on would mean I'm listening. She's just really testing it to the max. Beautiful. Josh had pressure on the whole time. Good girl. And this time she commits even more. Good girl. Good girl. Instead of 
going around. Another example of going around would be, well, let me up the value of a reward and see if she'll listen then. And then maybe she will, because now she wants to earn what you're, off, what you're offering, but you didn't go through the evidence. Right. So you're bypassing all these important conversations. And then by the time they become like, you know, six months to a year, year and a half, you've missed all those opportunities. Right. And now it's going to be really hard, really difficult. <laughs> As we're seeing. Yeah, right? So it's like every... Every little bit of attitude that a dog might give you as you're growing up, those are opportunities to correct and direct, correct yes. and direct. And if you're missing one, two, three, four hundred, five hundred, you know, as the year goes on, uh, then when it's time to correct, it's like now you have this big like exorcism that you have to do. Right. You have thousands of times that you should have corrected it, all put into this one moment, and yes. whoa, it's like this big ordeal. So. That's what happens. Basically, she raised without proper punishment. Yes. I say proper punishment because I guess they, they try yes. by putting her away. Um, and doing not, and the owner said she would do a lot of leash pops, but just wasn't, well, they obviously weren't wasn't enough. Yeah. And, and another thing about leash pops is you have to have a leash in the hand, which the dog knows when you don't. Right. The dog knows when you have that leash on, when it's not on. They know when it's in your hand. They know that you have to be a certain proximity to them. So then they start gamble. Essentially. And then there's probably, you know, if I, if I was a betting man, I would say there's a lot of inconsistency in the home from person to person to person. You know what I mean? Maybe one person is very committed, and then the other person not so much, yeah. and another person not at all. Yeah. You know what I mean? And so then the dog gets to play off from right. people so they know there's inconsistency. So now you get a dog who's just, you know, gambling, not listening. Like, I think I can get away with it now. No. And so... This is a good example of a dog who knows of the Never Never Land, right? They know of this place and this type of relationship where you don't really have to listen. And if, even if you do, it's your choice and it's to earn something. So they know that's available because we showed them that. So now when you get a different type of relationship where it's like, oh, I'll give you a house to live in and I'll give you a loving family, but you have to listen. Meaning if I say do, do. If I say don't, don't. Right? And then the dog said, well, what's in it for me? It's like, no, that's it. You're living with us. That's, <laughs> that's the trade. That's, that's the, the trade. deal. That's why you're here in the family. <laughs> yeah. Now, your job is to listen. Yes. That's it. My job is to make sure that you have a nice, loving family to live in. I don't have to exchange a valuable resource every time I ask you to do something. That's actually going to hinder your progress in the long run. I think why it looks good in the beginning is because the dog's interested in the food or the reward. So then you can see that the dog learns really quickly. Oh, they can learn to sit. They can learn the down. They can learn because this stuff's very easy. You don't need a piece of food for the dog to learn it. But we're saying we need. There's only two motivators in, in behavior, right? You have the motivation to earn. You have the motivation to avoid. That's it. That's that's what all you got. If we're just using that motivation to earn, it's not balanced. And the dog, the dog's either playing, it's playing a game. Do you want to play the game? The dog gets to choose whether or not they want to play the game. If they don't want to play the game, you're going to go get a better reward for them to want to play the game. And that leaves you with lack of respect. Sure, you can teach. Sure, you can teach. But you can't get respect. And so that's why they're not listening when you need it. Because we never tackle respect. How do you tackle respect? It's the same way he's going to get it from her or any other dog. It's like you set a boundary, or in our words, a rule. And if they don't comply, here's a punishment. Oh my gosh, and it's like the perfect storm because the dogs in the house were trying to do that, but they were, they're chihuahuas. You gotta love So that. if she had other dogs that were bigger than her or her size, she would be humbled by 100%. them. But she's like winning against multiple areas. So she's, she's areas winning with humans. And dogs. She's winning with dogs. So to her, she is she's Queen. top of yes. the hierarchy. Queen. Which is false. Yes. It's not even accurate in the real world. It's actually a big lie. She's not actually high up on any hierarchy. She's a puppy. Yes. Right? She, she would not be an, a natural dog pack. She wouldn't no. be. With humans, if we were being honest with her, she wouldn't be. Right? But with a modern, the modern home that dogs go to, um, people aren't seeing hierarchy. They're just seeing, let's have fun. Let's, let's give her comfort. Let's give her fun, you know, fun memories. It's just all fun, fun, fun. Oh wait, we can't control ourselves. her. There's nothing about control. Also, those yeah. chihuahuas are probably loving life right now. Now the chihuahuas <laughs> were giving you the answer the whole time. Yes. They're saying, here's the answer. You have to correct her. You have to punish her. 
They were saying that. And you have to do it like this. <laughs> you you got to bite it. You got to physically make it uncomfortable. They, they just couldn't do it. They're telling they're, you. They're, they're four inches high. They're showing you that that is actually indeed the answer. However, she's huge compared to them. They're not really, she's probably quick to move away from it. And now it's just fun, right? But like you said, if it was like a dog like Riggins or oh, some yeah. of the other dogs that we know. Yep. Over. Over. Stuff. Yep, it's over. Done. Look at her, she looks great. But she's also, she looks great, but she's kind of remote. Yeah, here. she's in a, a phase of like, I can't believe I have to listen. <laughs> I don't want to do this because I'm used to having it the other way. Yes, she's got the taste of freedom. And now, but if I was never that. showed the other way, she wouldn't know any different, she'd be happy to comply. Down. Beautiful. Oh, wow. Good wow. girl! Oh, that is really pretty. We celebrate. Oh, oh good girl. Oh. See what happens? Oh, nice. She looks so good. She, I would like her to. Um, she's on her way of getting there. But I would like her to see the the uh, the petting and the praise, very high value. The reward, and yeah. Really, really wanting to work and get that from right. You. That's ideal for the relationship. Oh, look at her. Good. And one of the ways you get that is you don't give away for free. Yeah. So you don't give. You know, I mean, I'm talking to modern day America where that's all we do, but. Ideally, you don't just get cuts away for free, and you don't just get praise away for free. Because that means really nothing, and it doesn't really, they don't really work for it. If you can withhold it and give it only when they're earning it, hey, you're doing good, let me pet you. You're doing good, let me tell you how good you're doing. Um, then, and also in contrast, when she's not doing good, let her know when she's not doing good, correct her. Then it all of a sudden it means a lot. Yes. The dog's trying to please you. Very clear, black and white, yep. yeah. And they're really, really, really trying to get that side of you. They really want to see you uh, happy with them and praising them and petting them. That's when you get a dog who's going out of the way to please you simply just to get that side of you out. They want the pet, like he's got it, right? Right? Okay. He don't get pet for nothing. He doesn't get told he's doing a good boy for nothing unless he's doing it, unless he's being good. Good. There you go, good girl. Nice work! Shadow. That's good, a good girl. girl. Break. Yeah. Who is it? Oh. Let me get that shadow. Place. Nice. Beautiful. Almost. She says, I just. I can't give it to him yet. Maybe if I just sit Please. here. He was just petting me. Maybe if I just be close to him. Nice. Good girl. Good job. That's a good, good girl. Now I know it's very, when you're doing that, and you're sending her to place or, or, or anything, but this is a good example. I know it's very tempting to think that she doesn't know what you're saying, so that you need to like over, you know, give her too much information, just give her more information. That's not what's happening, okay? This is, a, this is uh, at that moment, it is her not wanting to go in the bed because it means she's not gonna be involved. Right, and it also means she's listening. Exactly. <laughs> Which means she's giving you the leadership position, right. she's giving you control, right? So that right there, when she, she, she had many tells that she didn't know what I was saying. We know what we're looking for, so we can see it, you can see it. But she, so a common thing is, I uh, start to go and then I won't go, but what if I sit next to you? Or what if, what if I, I nestle I'm up? Here, but I'll sit right next I'm going to lay in front of the bed. I'll lay in front of the bed. Yes. Okay? Um, so that she's maintaining some type of. Well, uh, I chose this. Pitching in, yes. right? So, and we talk about the hierarchy. We got to remember if there's, there's one that. It gets a little, it gets a little, little gray area. I think people miss, miss. Uh, they, they, they don't see this as clearly. We, we know that we got a dog who sees themselves above us on the hierarchy, which is very clear. 
And we also know the position where a dog sees themselves as below, and they allow us to lead. But what about the moment where they see themselves as equal? Right? Negotiation. That's overlooked. Yes, negotiation is probably right. the most common. Democracy. Probably the most common. Right? We get to vote. She gets the influence. Well, you want to go in that direction, okay, we'll go in that direction, but we'll we'll do it at this pace. Yes. And we'll do we'll, we'll, I know you want to go that way, but we'll kind of just we'll kind of just do one be yes. okay? And it's like that has to get corrected. Yes. Because that's a dog trying to be at least equal. They don't want to be put down here. Yes, and that will not serve you well in moments you really need them to listen. Absolutely not. <laughs> if it didn't matter, I wouldn't be wasting time. No, if it didn't matter, do as you Who please. Cares? Who cares? But it does matter. <laughs> it does. So when you see a dog trying to negotiate, you have to, there is no, don't fall into the trap, which we see all the time, of them trying to actually negotiate with a dog. Where you're trying to, negotiation is like, then you're saying, Please. Oh, let me get something more valuable. Go okay. get a ball. Go exactly. get a treat. You're then trying to, it's as simple as this. You tell them to do something. They don't do it. You apply the correction. You ask again. They don't do it. You apply a correction a little firmer. You ask again, right? So that so it's just and that's what I was doing, but I was doing it very nonchalant. Yeah. Right. Because I want I'm also working with her, paying attention to my body, reading the room kind of thing. She knew that what to do from the very beginning that I said place that point to the back, right? But you see her try to get behind me, try to recall in front. We seen on the other rep, she she sat in front of it. Sometimes they'll lay down in front of it. It's the same. It's the same thing. It's just, it, it, if you're Anything walk, but listen. Yes, because essentially that's the conversation. That yes. Then you be happy. So don't negotiate. Correct that. You'll get a follower, which follower isn't equal, right? Unfortunately, boom. They're the follower. You're the leader. If they don't listen, there's consequences to keep them in line, right? Same thing as we just did a lot of driving around this morning, bringing dogs places. The same reason why we couldn't speed when we wanted to. Yes. I mean, there was times where we wanted to just whip around some of these slow boats, yes. right? I mean, to like force right on the corner, get people out of town. You want to go past some people. Why aren't we just doing what we want to do? Because we'll get punished. There's because laws in place. That cop's going to come over and give us a yes. nice ticket. We're going to have to go to court. God, that sucks. Punishment, literally, to keep everybody safe on the road. Yeah. That's how it's be. That's how we are safe. That's why we are safe. We need to apply that in our homes with our dogs, right? Here's the rules. Man, you don't listen to them, here's the punishment. Keep it there. Don't go and try to get into the negotiation. It's going to be put you in a very weak position. Mm -hmm. The dog's going to see this room to negotiate when you need them. And at the very worst, at the very, at the very least, it's going to be inconvenient. Yeah. Uh, at the worst, it can cause some really big problems. Okay? So, that's what she was doing. It's subtle. It's dog language. It's subtle like that sometimes. But that's what she did. And that, what she did right there, it didn't look like much, did it? It didn't look like much of a problem, but it was. And, it's, and, and it is in the category of attitude. Mild, but there. Sometimes it's very obvious when dog using attitude. Sometimes it's more mild like that, but that was there. Okay? <clears throat> Good girl. I'm getting a lot of You're eye getting eye, eye contact without asking, and that was something that, that is new. That's yes. a new skill. Lots and lots of eye contact. In fact, when I first brought her in the room today, I was getting so much eye contact, I couldn't work on eye contact. <laughs> because I was getting so much, I couldn't get her to stop looking at me so that I could say her name to get her to look at me. It took a while to just sit here and talk before she kind of put her head down and I could do it. So it's a good problem to have. Shadow. Break. Nice. Good girl. Wow. Good girl. You see that? That's what I love. Wow. Place. Amazing. Wow. And I haven't even done that yet. Good oh, girl. Amazing. That was perfect. That was a good girl. We gotta really build up that pride. That was perfect. Good girl. Oh. Wow! Wow! <laughs> She's giving you the hip. She's giving me the hip. That's all good. <laughs> Very nice because if I was a dog, that's what I would want as a dog. Right? So, good girl. Good, good girl. Yay! Wow! wow. We're spending time in this particular rep with the rewards. Good. Not every rep can be this crazy. Good. 
We really have to build up that pride in listening. Yes. Because it was so hard for her, we need to show her it's really worth it to listen. Yes. Yes. And she's getting this level of good, good old yeah. She's not getting this for free, right? She's earned this. Good girl. Look at she likes that. That's a good girl. Now that, those zero attitude, went right to the bed. We haven't even done a rep on this bed. Um, and she just went right over. So the reason it was smoother is not because she had more knowledge than last time. It's because she did. She had no attitude. She just went. Mm -hmm. That's really girl. what we've been chipping away at. Good girl. Yes. Yes, it's really nice. So she's starting to really like that phrase, mm -hmm. that cutting. That's what we want. We want that super value. We want her to want to work for that. Good. Nice. Look, look, look at it. Wow, she can't get enough of it. Look at this. And then this is where you'll start building the pride, like you said, where the prideful. So, yeah, again, not every rep's going to be like this, but for her and I, on this particular one, good. <laughs> Very nice. Wow, look at that. And then we see confidence go up, but confidence in being a follower. Yeah. So it's, it, it's you'll, you'll see the pride, the pep in the step, but it's from being a list, uh, listening and for being a follower rather than being a brat and being independent, which is a nice way of saying they don't listen. Good. Yeah, the, the breeders will call them sassy. Sassy is a good word. Sassy, yeah, you hear that um, a lot. Independent. They won't say brat. Uh, what else do they say? They'll say uh, strong will. They'll say strong will. They'll say independent a lot. So if they say like she's independent, you can know that that means that she doesn't listen. Uh, if they say strong will, the same thing, they'll listen. Sassy, they're going to give you an attitude. Basically, the dog doesn't listen. Is, is the, that's the nice way they're putting But they're trying to tell you, they're not being direct. They are giving, they're giving you a little, yeah. Um, good. So if you're, if you're getting the dog and they're like, very independent. Uh, that means she does not listen. That's what that means. She said that's code, okay? Good. Uh, it's also followed up by, but they're very sweet, right? Or something, they'll, they'll add something in there, right? right? Sweet and sour. Yeah. Sweet and sour. Sour patch kid. Uh, yeah. Uh, they're not going to say she's a spoiled brat and she doesn't listen. Because <laughs> that's not going to get them home, right? It's not going to get them into a house. Good. And at the end of the day, the breeders, even though they love what they do, most of them, you know, I imagine that they really love what they do, it's a business. Yeah. Their dog needs to, you know, they, they need to sell a dog, and the dog needs to go into a home. And it ain't gonna happen if they're like, this dog doesn't listen, it's, 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 it's driving me nuts, <laughs> please take it, it's not gonna go home, right? Good. Good. Plus, they're eight, 12 weeks old when they're getting homes. They're barely even, the, the consciousness is barely even there. So they don't even know them that well yet. Good. Good. Look at this. This is beautiful. This is a very good girl. I'm very proud of you. We could not get here though with this level of pride that she's feeling without going through all the, the week and a half that we've done. How long has she been here? Two weeks of correcting all the nonsense, correcting all of the, just the, <laughs> the sassiness. <laughs> yeah, all of that, that we had to go through. And now we build up. Now we're building up, and she's gonna be um, in a really, really good place. Good, good, she's gonna be her best version, that's right. Shadow, good girl. Break! Wow! wow. She's like, I'm comfy, I'm comfy here. Good girl. Great. It's almost Good like the end girl. of a massage. You like can't think. Good girl. Yeah. 